everybody. Hi, it's Becky from PowerToolsWithThread.com. That's my blog. <laughs> I just got back from the uh, OESD embroidery event at All Brands in San Antonio. And, uh, yeah, I had a great time. It was two days, so yesterday and today. Um, what's today? 13th? April? I don't know. Anyway, I can't keep straight. <laughs> Somebody just text me. Hold on. So one of the cool things about being... My dog just ran behind the tripod and missed it. <laughs> Look! <laughs> one of the cool things about going to those events is uh, you get to meet a whole bunch of like-minded people and just the nicest, sweetest... I think Stitchers are some of the nicest people around, really. Uh, it's just... It's just amazing. They're always willing to share their knowledge and their talent and their experiences. And, uh, it's, you know, we're, what we do is kind of a lonely, uh, a lonely hobby for the most part. So it's always fun to uh, get into a room around other people that are there with the same enthusiasm that you are. So um, I'm going to show you guys my haul of what I bought while I was there. Of course, you have to buy something. They give you 20% off while you're there. So... Uh, it, you're kind of crazy not to get it at the show price and then at the end of this I will put in uh, I took my video camera around and showed the uh, all of the CDs that they had for sale and all of the um, the store the store is huge ginormous store and then uh, around in the class and right now I want to apologize for the audio on that clip I'm walking around with it and I was trying to keep it pretty steady but I'm holding it right here, and it's it's loud, and at the end, my voice goes a little high where I'm like, ah! <laughs> Sorry about that. I did everything I could on my audio uh, editor in the video program to bring it down and drop the mixer and the equalizer and all whatever other stuff that is. But uh, it gets a little screechy there at the end, so if you're wearing earphones, pull them out. Okay, so what all did I get? Um, I picked up, so the CDs that they had were buy two, get one free. You did not get the 20% off if you did that. So I got two of the embroidered kitchen towels. Um, these are great if you're going to, you know, you can do, uh, like, it has, this one has pumpkin pie, gingerbread cookies, strawberry shortcake, eggnog, sugar cookies, and chocolate fudge. And then this one is cocktail recipe towels. And it has the classic martini, Long Island iced tea, Mai Tai, Moscow Mule, Bloody Mary, Margarita, White Russian, Pina Colada, and the Mojito. So, um... I got these because these are great to do on towels uh, and to wrap around a bottle of alcohol for Christmas or birthdays. And then I also got quilting blooms. I picked up this one. Let me, you can see it better on the back. Can you see? I like this because this is almost like red work. And it is... Uh, um, I, I would like to do like tone-on-tone -tone embroidery stitching on clothing. So I thought that this might be a nice one to give a try. You got to be careful, you know, because clothing has different weights. And if you do it on anything lightweight, it might start tugging and pulling. And anyway, I'm not savvy with that yet. So I thought I would start with something like this. Not that I don't have anything like this. I'm sure if I went through all of my CDs, I'd find something. But eh, it was there. This was the freebie. So I went ahead and got it. Um, so let's see. What else did I get? The OESD press cloth, this, they say it's a special um, kind of material. It's not batting. It has some acetate or something. I don't know. It says it takes all the puckers out of, uh, out of your work that you do. And I had done a, uh, hold on, let me get it. I didn't show you guys this before but I did this is a designs by Juju one of their new birth announcements that they have and I did this for a co-worker uh, he got his first grandson and so 
I did it, but it's got a, a few puckers in it, and I'm it's I'm sure it's not the design. I'm sure it's me. So I'm going to actually um, put this. I mean, it turned out really nice, but it's got puckers. So I'm gonna give it the try, and I will let you guys know if it can get the puckers out like it says it does. Then I probably have to take some woven uh, iron-on and put it on the back to keep it so that it doesn't contract as it cools. You know, that's what the lady said to do. So I got that, and then I also bought a pair of the alligator clamps scissors. I got these. Those are handy if you're putting together pieces of uh, freestanding lace things where you, you got to reach through something and grab it and pull it. And okay, um, I did not make all of the projects there. Uh, the only one I got through completely is the little zipper pouch that we have. And I managed to uh, put the lining on inside out. Whatever. It's fine. And um, I tell you in my video on the walkthrough that this nice lady, Michelle, uh, from Poteet, she swapped out a little, um, really cute little swatch pack is what they call it. It's a charm pack, but it's not by Moda. This is, um, this is Nordic Holiday by Contempo cut and assembled in the USA. So, um, there's the fabrics that are in it. So that's really nice. I had won a little fan thing, little USB fan, and I was like, man, that's, that's not what I wanted. And then the next thing they, you know, that was for the door prizes, we did door prizes throughout the whole event, was this fabric, and I was like, I want the fabric. So, I was kind of teasing when Michelle won the fabric. I was like, you want to trade? She goes, okay. I was like, what? It's so sweet. She said, I have more fabric. And uh, and then another lady was giving away these charms that she uses, as, can be used as zipper pulls. She was just giving them away. She had tons of them. I couldn't believe it. And so I got this one. It's the USA with a heart in the middle. Isn't that pretty? That'd make a nice zipper pull on a red, white, and blue little, um, on a little red, white, and blue tote, don't you think? Or not a tote, but a, a zipper pouch. That'd be cool, huh? And what else? Um, okay, so that's it for the event. They gave us a USB stick, and it's got lots and lots of cool stuff on it. So my uh, table partner, Anne Marie, was going through it, and we were, like, gawking at all of the... You could see them all in the... We were on the Dream Machine 2, Brother Dream Machine 2, so you could see all of the designs that were on the stick in full color, and really, really nice stuff we got. So... In all, I think uh, I think it was a good trip. I'm really glad that I went, and um, I'm really I want to thank all of you who subscribed because I was like, I need to get to 3,000 subscribers. <laughs> they were over there subscribing, and it went ding. I said, Yay! <laughs> you guys are awesome. Thank you. Okay, so I'm uh, today. I'm going to finish up my hus the collar on my husband's fishing shirt. I am. Um, I'm in the home stretch on that, so I'm going to get that done today. And then I started yesterday. I started. Um, I got some. I started my blue bonnet panel, and um, I went ahead and took the. Um, I used my regular sewing machine, and I just went around the outside of the blue bonnets, and then all on the green on the inside, the little cutout pieces. And I got um, the idea that I could free motion this. And I started this hot mess right here, this down in this corner. Do you see this mess right there? I started that and said, oh no, that's why I don't free motion. And so I got a, uh, I pulled out one of my stencils for a crosshatch and um, a pounce. And I just did that corner of it. And crosshatch that, and I think that turned out really nice. And so I hopefully can finish this today or tomorrow. I decided not to put any borders on it. I did the. Um, I keep looking behind me so I don't sit like miss my seat and land on my keister. <laughs> this is this teal grunge, is the uh, scrap that was left over from the backing from the rhino quilt that I made last week or finished last week. And same with the batting. And I'm just going to do that 
blue I had shown y'all that matches it's right here. I'm just going to do the binding on this. I'm not going to do any borders on it at all. Just, just going to do the binding and uh, hang it on the wall here in my sewing room. So I've got blue bonnets year round. But uh, anyway, so that's about it for today. Oh, I did pick up some fabric while I was there. Um, remember the Easter Lily quilt, quilt I told you I wanted to make? Missouri Star, that was from Sweet Pea Machine Embroidery. And uh, just gorgeous. And Missouri Star, the I wanted to do a, uh, what's that called? Oh, I had the word earlier. It just went poof. This fabric where it goes from dark to light. That's what somebody did theirs in on Sweet Pea. There is an example of this. They had this fabric at, uh, oh, it looks, it looks more striated in the camera picture than it does in person. Huh. I may not use this one after all. What is that? Anyway. So I bought that. And I uh, don't know if I use it. And then they had some nice fabric. that Coastal fabrics. And I thought I would just take. And. Um, like just take a square of this little. Fish and crabs. And that kind of thing. And starfish. And just frame it. You know. Just put a little white frame around it. Um. And maybe do a border. I don't know. I just want some pictures down at the coast that are not quilts. Just frames of fabric may work. We'll see. I don't know. But it's pretty stuff. So I got out of there for 112 bucks. Not bad. Because the last time I went to an embroidery event, it was way more than that. Of course, I bought software. So, All right, you guys. So that's it. I had a great time. Thank you so much to everybody um, at All Brands. And thank you so much uh, for being such good sports about my YouTube channel. All you uh, ladies who were in the class, I enjoyed meeting every one of you. And I hope to see you around our little stitching world again. Okay? We'll talk to you soon. Bye. Okay, I am here at the OESD event. Uh, this is in uh, Creative Sewing Center in San Antonio. Uh, the one that's at, there are two of them. This is the one that's at Bitters and uh, West, or uh, right there. So look at all of these CDs when you come to these events. They have a deal at the event where you can buy two, get one free. So you know I had to snatch up something like that. But they have so many of these. CDs that we get to play with. Well, no, that you can purchase. We're not playing with all of these. Would you guys look at this? Isn't that gorgeous? This is um, panels, the pieces that you put together. And here's one. This is Starry Night. Look at this. Isn't that gorgeous? The instructor said it takes like 30 hours or something like that to stitch it out. It's crazy. She's made four of them. Isn't that beautiful? Let me step back so you can see the whole thing. I don't, I'm sorry I'm, if I'm too jiggly here. Isn't this beautiful? Go ahead, sweetie. You're all right. <laughs> I got these ladies walking around me. They're like camera shy. <laughs> and they have a bunch of stabilizer and stuff here that we can buy. And um, anything we buy at these events are 20% off. So that's really nice. Would you look at this store? Look how big it is. Oh, it's going to rain. Oh, it's getting dark outside. This, this is the uh, Creative Sewing Center. You're okay. <laughs> so, uh, look at that. Aren't those nice? Isn't that beautiful? The only reason I wouldn't get a Bernina is because all of the stuff I have in my life is brother. Now, there, there it is right there. The 10 needle brother. That's what I want. I'm trying to talk hubs into ch um, trading out the Janome MB7, but he's not really going for it right now, so... Would you look at this store? This this place is amazing. Here's all the. I took. Uh, oh, there's a lot of you have this. The Grace Canique. Look, there's the 21. Isn't that nice? And it's got the tablet on top of it. I don't know what it has in it, but this uh, is this the Phoenix frame. I don't know what it is. I don't know which frame that is. And then they have a Bernina long arm back here. 
These are just for sale. They do not do long arm quilting here uh, as a service, I don't believe. So, but look at this store. It's huge, huge store. This store has been here forever. And look at that. So this is what we're working on here. The Dream Machine 2, that's the one at my table. And there are some people who have the new Luminaire, the Brother Luminaire. There's the Dreamweaver XE. I have the Innovus Quattro, which I really like. There's the Luminaire. And it is identical, identical to the Baby Lock Solaris in every way, shape, form, including the price. But, um, you know me, power tools with thread. I love my sewing machines. Love these machines. But, um, so anyway, want to wave? Hi. <laughs> You're going to be on YouTube. Oh, okay. <laughs> Hi, YouTube fans. This Charlotte is from All Brands. Charlotte from All Brands. Thank you so much for hosting us. Oh, you're very welcome. We're having a great time. You have a wonderful classroom set up here. Thank you. Thank yeah. You. So, um, try. well, good. <laughs> and then with all the fabric and stuff they have here, they have... They have a lot of fabric that you, a lot of times you can only find online. I'm just going to walk you guys around the store a little bit. Hey there. Hi. They have, you want to say hi to my YouTube fans? Sure. Hi. 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 All Brands. Yeah. <laughs> Y'all, All Brands, you guys are uh, headquartered out of Slidell or Lake Charles? Baton Rouge. Baton Rouge. See, I had that all wrong. Okay. All right. Well, I have had nothing but wonderful customer experience with all brands. Thank you so much for saying so. And I send a lot of customers your way Good. on my ta on my channel. So, yeah, look at all the threads, you guys. We just got the ice accordion. Really? Tuesday, and we're fix finishing filling it up. I love this. Are you carrying all 100 and plus colors? All 423. 423 colors of ice accord. I long arm quilt with isocord. Uh, my machine, I have a Tin Lizzie, well, King Quilter, uh -huh. and it likes isocord. So, look at that. Isn't that wonderful? That's fabulous. So, look at all of the stuff they have in this store. <laughs> Just going to walk around and show you what they got. So, what are y'all's thoughts on these pressing pads, besides the fact that they're outrageously priced? I, I, I don't know that I want them, because what I have works. I don't know. I'm kind of, uh, I don't know. So the, this store sells Bernina and Brother and Baby Lock, or B Bernina and Brother. So uh, lots and lots of things here that are normally you can only find them online. But, oh, here we go. More embroidery thread. Look at that. Okay, so, man, look at that storm coming in. Holy moly. I hope the boys are not out on the water. All right. So, I'm going to walk back here. And I'll show you guys the, more of the classroom. Okay, and a sweet, sweet lady came in, and she had lots of charms to go on uh, zipper pulls, and she put them out there for all of us to take one. Isn't that nice? And she's, she's not even here with the class. Uh -huh. So the things we're making in this class are the kitchen towel holder there, the luggage tag, the zipper pouch, uh, the trivet, and the napkin, the lace napkin. So that's what came in the kit with this, uh, with this class. And then here we have snacks, and they fed us Subway yesterday. And, oh, that's a cute quilt. Look at that, Santa through the window. I love it when people do that with panels. That's really neat. So, 
It is so fun to be in a room with like-minded people. So fun. Valerie, you want to wave? There's Valerie from Scrappy Quarter. Hi, Valerie. <laughs> I live in San Francisco. This is Michelle. Let me show everybody what you have done. Isn't that gorgeous? <gasps> Where and the horse on the front. Where did you get the embroidery designs for that? Oh, need a good design? Okay. Well, nice. Hi, sweetheart. These two beautiful ladies are from Poteet, Texas. Salute, right? <laughs> this sweet Michelle, she swapped out her uh, her fabric she won yesterday with me for a thing that I won, a little fan that I was not interested in. But anyway, so here we are. So, let me see if I can get everybody to, uh, let me see. Hi, class. They're from everywhere. Say hi, everybody. Hi. Ah, oh, thank you so much. We're, we're sharing. Hi, Emily. Where'd she go? There she is. Okay. All right, you guys. Y'all, thank you so much.